Peggy 7. In the beginning of the game, you're in the Hogwarts library, and you immediately meet this character, the professor, who is hopefully like the best teacher you've ever had. So the book is split into five chapters, and each chapter represents um, qualities of a wizard. So it could be importance of practice, any, any kind of attribute that a young wizard or witch would need to progress in the wizarding world. So once we had that kind of skeleton of these five chapters, and, and a theme for each one, then we tied in four spells per chapter. So the first thing uh, the player might do is learn the incantation for the, for the incendio spell, for example. So they have to repeat the words on, that are shown on the screen. And then the next stage is to perform the gesture, which is a simple shape drawn with a move controller. And then they might go into a, into a practice environment where they fight some magical creatures with this new spell. Once you've learned those four spells, there's an end of chapter test which will then test you on those spells. And that will take you through kind of many different areas that have tasks that require you to use all of the four spells that you've learned in that chapter. When you first cast a spell, a uh, spell effect appears on the end of your wand, so you can immediately tell what spell you have cast. So for example, the Aguamenti spell, which is the water spell, is a blue bubbling orb on the end of it. And when you pull the trigger of the motion controller, this orb turns into water spraying out from the end of your wand. You're also given backstories and histories to these spells, and they're played out within a paper theatre. I wanted something that was of the book, but was also quirky, funny, playful in itself. So I think what we've got now is, is some people have described it as a reinvention of the book. It's the first time that we've put the magic wand in your hand, we've put the spell book in your hand, and you get to be the one casting all of these really iconic spells.